Misty here this morning with you guys and I decided I'm going to color in Mermaid Wonders today with you guys on camera Deborah Muller I have never colored in this book it's a beautiful book um, the cover feels good it's got really good paper it's not Amazon paper either it's a different feel of paper and uh, I got this book this book right here wasn't dated for some reason either which is strange when I got it. I did get it off of Amazon at least three or four years ago, I'd say. But this one right here is the one I want to color. And, um, let's see. On the back it has a saying. So on the back of this page it says, Sing like no one's listening, love like you've never been hurt, dance like nobody's watching, and live... Like it's heaven on earth, Mark Twain. So I went through here last night and I thought, yep, I'm going to color a mermaid. I've just been in the mood to color a mermaid. So that's what I want to do. And I still want to use my own markers. I just not stop using them now I'm gonna color her skin just um, a peach color I believe this will do good right here uh, and after our color a little bit I'll show you show you this book but yeah the paper is excellent it's excellent paper no idea like I said it's strange isn't it there's no no date on the back either showing when I got it but then I got it off of Amazon because uh, let's say now it was about Four years ago, I decided to get a bunch of Deborah's books, as many as I could. Yeah. Which I'm glad I did. I do like her big eyes too. The line art here in this book in in here is really nice. It's um, darker line art. I'm gonna go over these stars and then color them something probably in a minute. Yesterday, that picture I colored with you guys, I forgot to put my cardstock down. I put it down, but I put it down on the wrong page. So, the page after it got ruined, which was a bummer. Don't you hate when that? Every now and then it happens, I put it down on the wrong page. Betty called me yesterday while I was recording, and I didn't know it till after. My phone didn't ring, and she was needing us to get her medicine. And Monroe's, but we ended up having to go back to town after Dwayne come home and take Betty back to town. So Betty ended up getting, <clears throat> had to wait a little while, it seemed like, to get her medicine um, at the pharmacy. They, they was covered up. And two of, uh, they had, I think, four workers in there, but two of them went on lunch break at the same time, it looked to me like. And she has a hard time standing, too. She stood there at least 15 minutes. I had to sit down for a little bit. They need a chair closer to where you wait to get the medicine, but they got them over farther in the corner. I felt bad for Betty having to wait. And then we had to stop at the other pharmacy and get Marno's medicine. 
But he come out with a big bag of medicine. And I said, well, uh, is that all Monroe? She said, no, it's uh, something about appreciation, customer appreciation. So they, they give her a big bag of stuff, whatever it was. We went into the uh, Family Dollar for Betty and got Buddy's dog food. So she wouldn't have to go in there. She has a hard time walking around. I didn't mind getting out again. I was glad to get out. I know it was rough on Dwayne. Because as soon as he come home, we had to go back out again. But didn't really have a choice on it. And Betty couldn't wait till today and get the medicine. Dwayne could have went in and got it today. and But she couldn't wait to get it. Monroe was out, so about it. Oh, the exciting day when Dollar Tree opened in Bryson. That's been since last April, and it's, it's, um, not as exciting as it was when it first opened. But still, I'm glad we actually got a Dollar Tree with Family Dollar. Didn't think that would ever happen. First time coloring in here. You can tell the paper's good. Whatever the paper is, it's good paper. Strange, strange, strange. This is the first book I've ever bought that's been like this off of Amazon. That is really good like this. That don't have the Amazon paper. Really strange, but true. Yeah, I went with Betty and the Ingles, too. She had to get a few things, so... Um, Dwayne got him something to eat for supper and come on out and eat. Well, I walked around with Betty a little bit in the store. Got some Brunswick stew to eat for supper yesterday. I was just... The uh, past two days in one of those moods where I, I'm just going to eat and not worry about it. And not worry about, you know, eat, drinking the shakes. Even this morning, got some pop cereal yesterday. Could not wait to get up this morning eat some of that pop cereal. I got some almond milk. It was about 30 calories. But for lunch, I'll, I'll drink a shake. And for supper, I'll eat a lean cuisine. Um, lasagna, I guess. Probably go to, we'll probably go to Waynesville Sunday and get groceries. Might go to Food Line um, in Waynesville instead of going to Murphy. Kind of burnt out on Murphy again. I like this red color. She looks like a redhead, doesn't she? So I hope y'all are doing good this wonderful morning. This week's about gone now. It's Friday. Yeah, I was looking at the calendar, so I'll be recording what I colored for you guys Tuesday. Tuesday's the 1st of August. So that'll be a fun video because you guys haven't seen what I colored a lot of it. Just a few, mostly Christmas pictures. And my chat pictures, of course. Might do that again in August. I really enjoyed doing that. Not showing on Instagram what I call her. So I, did, I enjoyed doing that. Maybe.
Maybe so. I'm not sure. There's some, well, let's see. So these mermaids are pretty easy to color, it looks like. There's not a lot of detail in the picture. Yeah, I told Dwayne last night, I said, um, I'm going to color another mermaid on camera. Color a, a colored tube, didn't I, with you guys on camera before this? Seemed like I did. I managed to find five watermelon Gatorades in Ingles yesterday. Dwayne said he would look today and make sure they didn't have any more. Because I like, I like drinking about one a day of it. I'm drinking one now before I start my water. There's pink again. I meant to grab yellow and I grab pink, pink instead. I want to color, I'll color the bow yellow. I've been doing that. I've been seeing colors as not the right color for some reason. I don't know what it is. Cause I, cause I swore when I looked at this it was yellow. I fixed the page. It turned out okay yesterday. The sum off drawing page. I had to basically pretty much take out the page they call. Luckily, it didn't, the yellow didn't show up on the birds. It was mostly on the tree. So, um, mostly what I ended up doing was to, I had to take out the page because when I used the page they called for, you could still see the yellow. So I just had, it worked out. I just covered it up with um, a light, I mean a dark brown. Dark brown's what, what helped it. So I used dark brown instead of peach. There's some more hair I gotta color. That page was really bad though. Oh, it was really yellow. Mm -hmm. It was really yellow. This paper is kind of hard to color on for some reason. Let's come back to that bow in a minute. This marker, I don't know. Let me know, guys, what you're coloring today while you're watching me on camera. What you're coloring. Now, I'm going to try to tomorrow to record a video. And then Sunday, Monday, not record, probably Tuesday, record what I colored. And then probably two, also record a video showing a flip of the books I finished. After I show what I colored. So that'll be fun to do for you guys, for sure. Yeah, I seem to always miss the hair somewhere on Deborah's pictures because they have a lot of pretty puffy hair. The girls does. Uh, the crows is getting the corn really bad. Yeah, Monroe mentioned it to Dwayne yesterday about the crows and. Yep, we ain't gonna have much corn. And Dwayne even had that scarecrow up. But it didn't help. The scarecrow did not did not help the the crows from getting the corn. No, I thought the scarecrow would help. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm, I did. It was a good scarecrow Dwayne put up. Yep, Dwayne checked them yesterday, this corn and I heard this morning I heard him taking a fit up there the, the crows in the garden too. They're glad to get that corn they, and they're eating it and that and the corn in the garden there's nothing like it. It's good. Just like potatoes. Dwayne said there's plenty of potatoes left, which is good. Ketchup, love ketchup. I'm gonna have to watch how I do things because as much as I love the Dorito ketchups, if I've got them, I'll eat them. So I'm just not gonna have to do it. Dwayne's got the little box and he's got a lot, but still, I don't need to put stuff in it. So I ended up eating the two ghost peeps last night. I got, they, they was pretty good. And Dwayne ate one. I had three and all. So no, I cannot do it. Even though I have a, even though I have a uh, snack box locked up, still eventually you're gonna want to go crazy and eat it, eat it all at one time. It's the way I am. That one evening I eat a bunch of suckers with the chewing gum in it. Couldn't stop myself. Yep, you're going to go crazy with it eventually. And you can't stop yourself. Well, Dwayne said Sinead O'Connor was going to go on tour. You know, but maybe we'll find out what happened to her. She was. She was planning on going on tour. And, that, and then she passed away. Find out what happened, hopefully. Gosh, some people on my Instagram was calling the poor little lady a he. I posted a, somebody's art they colored. Two people ended up calling her a he on the post. Crazy. She always had the short hair, but Sinead O'Connor is not a he. For sure. And you think they know Sinead O'Connor is not a he. But yeah, two, not one, but two people. Was, I just deleted the comments. I mean, they was nice about it, but they was calling her he instead of a she. Bless her heart. Bless her little heart. Oh my goodness, I'm going to tell you guys, the day before yesterday... I mean, you've got to be a strong person around death and stuff, and Dwayne, Dwayne is, but he was talking to this guy in one of the rooms. Just The guy was just talking away to him in one of the residents, and um, Dwayne went out, and 15 minutes later, he said, I went there, and said he was dead. The guy was dead. Oh, my goodness. Dwayne said there was nothing wrong with him. He didn't seem like he was fixing to die or anything, guys. And um, I said, Dwayne, what did he talk about to you? I, I said, you was the last person he saw before he died. Dwayne said he talk, asked me about the garden. Talked to me, asked me about the garden. I said, my goodness. That would bother me. 
It doesn't bother Dwayne too bad, but it would bother me. It would. Yeah. Yeah, he said nothing was wrong. I mean, it didn't seem like anything was wrong. He was talking away to Dwayne, and then 15 minutes later, he was gone. I'm glad Dwayne told me about that because I wanted to tell you guys about it, too. Shows how fast you can go in an instant. No, yeah, I don't even, didn't even know he was going to die. Goodness. I hope I'm coloring her okay. She is an easy mermaid to color, isn't she? I just used to grab different colors. Well, they're calling, the weather's calling for 60% rain today, so it could rain a little bit sometime in the evening, I think, more than the evening time. walk yesterday evening much because it was just it was way too hot way too hot to walk I, I got a little bit of walking in hope the dog's up down the hill hot day Maggie really Really bad baggy too. So I didn't try it. That was fun yesterday opening the Tamu package. Um, Dwayne didn't get a chance to look at the clippers. I was gonna show him the clippers that I opened. I like this purple better. It's darker. A darker purple. Let's see here. Uh oh. Darn it. change her skin to darker brown for some reason. I don't know. Or, I don't know, I marked it one spot pink. Well, how would she look as a darker colored one? I think she would look good with dark skin. Let's see right here, I put pink instead of a uh, peach. This is, but let's try this color. Make her skin brown instead of peach because just to be doing I 
dark skin, blue eyes, and red hair. Uh, hopefully, this this uh, be a, pretty, a good skin tone. Yeah, I like it. I like it better, I believe. Got to gather up stuff for my Medicaid on the third. They want to know for some stupid reason how many vehicles you got and um, what you got in the bank. Cause I get some kind of Medicare help for my medicine, so I've got to remember to do that. Not for yet to do it. Oh, yeah, I like it. Let's see now. Let's see if I can see. Is this caramel? Yep, this is caramel. She's going to be a caramel lady. Dark skinned mermaid. I was thinking this color was caramel. I've been using it some because uh, the other day I remember when I touched a marker, I was using what it was. It was caramel. Oh, goodness. Well, at least it won't be hot today if it rains, I guess. But a lot of times when it rains, it makes it worse, doesn't it? Seems like. Goodness, I was watching Arnie's live, and Nani may got, she talks on there, Nani, she got, she said it was a wasp, but I don't know, and she probably should have went to the doctor, but she didn't. She had, she showed a picture, she had a big bruise on her leg, where she, she said she got stung twice by a wasp, but I would have been going to the doctor, that just didn't look good at all. It was a big bruise on the side of her, um out of her leg. Dwayne said it sounds more like a hornet than a wasp. I was wanting to tell you guys about it. I've been watching Arnie. He comes on at 8 o'clock in the evening and I think the not last chan not the last video video before I showed you guys the link to Arnie's channel. And most of the time on if I go on live I just sit and watch them. I don't really say anything. So I'm there, but I just don't say anything, which is bad I know, but what I want yeah, when there's not many lives anymore, it doesn't seem like either on YouTube. Not a lot of coloring people does lives either or chats much. Which is really fun. But Kitty's coloring said she'd be doing one sometime soon again. I asked her because I enjoyed her video where she showed what she colored with the crayon there. That was really pretty. I enjoyed that. Also, Nani was getting the Animal Crossing. There's two other ones on there that she's going to start playing on doing with. I need to get back on my Animal Crossing really bad. If it wasn't for coloring, I'd done been on it. Yep, I would have done been on it if it hadn't been for coloring.
because that's mostly what I like to do all day is color. Just sit and color, you know. She's got her name signed beneath, uh, beneath the mermaid here. D. Muller. It's probably one of her new, uh, older books when she first started. I bet you it is. But this is an excellent book right here. I'm just really excited to be coloring it with you guys. On camera, the first page actually in it. Now this page, I will probably use eyeshadow on the background because there's a lot of, it would be hard to go around those stars, so, or I could color over this, yeah, well, either way, I could, I could color over the stars and go back, I guess. I like this purple. Gosh. I'm here in crows. I haven't seen a lot of bats. Sometimes you can see them right before it gets dark. Uh, flying pretty good, but not this time around. Oh yeah, that crow. That's really bad about the corn, though. It's a bummer. Apparently, scarecrows doesn't work, do they? I thought they did. Wish we had more thrift stores in town. We used to have more. And the ones we have is not good now, so that's a bummer. There's a big one across from McDonald's, but you just can't ever find anything in it. I guess it depends on what you're looking for. What did I do with my... You want me to put your pillow down in here? Or you can sit down on it and get your pillow. Oh, the sun is shining. Here you go. Here. Here you go, buddy. Here you go, buddy. Come here, little buddy.
Guys, let me know what your favorite song is of all time. I'd like to know. Comment, let me know what what your favorite song is. Um, and what year was your favorite music? You know, what area of music did you like best? And I don't really, honestly, I don't know what my favorite song is. But maybe you guys can tell me what yours is. Maybe you can tell me so I'll know, right? Shirley's real bad, stopped up and congested, and then Mary's got it now. It takes it was, this was Shirley, COVID. This one lady, uh, Dwayne worked with, she got it, she went on a cruise. And come back with it. It's still out there. It's awful, but it still is. I'm going to have to be careful. Twain said he's wondering if we didn't get COVID at Christmas time. I'm wondering too. Because it was really bad. They said the flu, but I'm wondering about it. Even now. Sickest I've ever been in my life, I believe. Let me go down a little so you can see me coloring up here. I downloaded the Happy Color app yesterday looking for Halloween and I didn't see anything like that. Like they've got ha holidays. Go on there, but. So, close to Halloween, that'll be entertaining. Try do, I'll uh, go on Happy Color again. They should be adding some Halloween pictures to color. That'll be good. Happy Color didn't look too entertaining yesterday. So I read on Facebook, and that's true, a lot of the soap, soap operas are flopping because they don't have good writers. Although I do want to watch General Hospital again because Bon Bon, she likes it so well. And I do like General Hospital, no matter what. I haven't watched it in a while. Now, a couple years ago, I watched Days of Our Lives, and it was really good then. When Cleo was taking care of Shirley, that's been a couple years ago, but... It's one of those areas where when you watch it, you don't forget it, you know. It was good. Not sure how it is now, though, Days of Our Lives, but it was good then, definitely. Yeah, usually I'm not into Color Mermaids, but I'm liking Color Mermaids with you guys on camera. It just depends on your mood, I guess, basically. And I'm in a mood for some reason to work in Kirsten Schneeva's book. She's got one color dots, and usually I do not like the one color dots, and for some reason I want to do it. Yes, late yesterday I did one with uh, a gray gel pen, and it was a turtle. Turned out to be a turtle. I'm doing one today with a little bit of a darker blue color. Well, more of a lighter blue teal. So I'm in the mood to do that now. And I looked on her page. She's got two in all mystery circles. And they don't seem to be as hard to do as the sunlight drawing ones. More relaxing and not as many dots. Maybe I'll get Kayla Christopia's new book today. They're going to send me their new book. And when I get it, I'll color page with you guys on camera. It's a Halloween one, color by number. So I might get it today in the mail.
I like these bones around the picture. I hope Margaret's doing okay. I'm gonna have to check and see if she's posted. I'll be able to go on Instagram, it looks like tomorrow, and start commenting in my heart and again. Goodness gracious, it's been about, today's a week. It's absolutely terrible. They don't know it's me, so they have blocked me from doing that for seven days. Seven darn days, guy, guys. But it's just, I miss it, being able to heart pictures and comment on pictures. I don't even go on Instagram. I just say, I go on Instagram to see who like my pictures because that's about all that I really can do. And po luckily, like I said before, I can still post. That would be awful if I couldn't post something. Crazy. They need to figure out something. Oh, man. Because that's just crazy. And if you tell them, you tell them it's you, but that don't make a difference because they're still going to, they're still going to block you regardless of what you say from doing things. Now, this doesn't have to be perfect. It can be a little blotchy. I have to be careful around the hair now with this. The blue's not going down really well, though, on this paper. I like the way it looks, though. The effect, it kind of looks like a cloudy, a cloudy, oh my goodness. I'll probably go around her with dark blue, too, just to be doing it for do this. I'm not sure. Well, this looks good like this, though, the way it's doing. I, drink, I haven't seen Ruth in forever. That's Bernice's mama. Goodness gracious, I dream she was playing video games. Why in the world do you dream things? But I can't remember what the video game was, but she was playing it. I would love to see Ruth. I haven't seen her in a long time. I'm glad Daddy's got uh, Legend of Zelda to play. He plays it a lot. See, the last time I think I went on Animal Crossing was like in October of last year before I went on it. Gosh, yes, it's been that long. Probably. That's bad. I've been enjoying going on memories on Pinterest. I showed Dwayne a few things yesterday that was really entertaining. That was um, Pinterest memories. Well, from, a lot of it from the 80s and the, some from the 70s. The Barbie pool was really cool back in the 80s. I always wanted one of those Barbie pools. That was hard to get. I think I had a little green one, a little green pole that you blowed up. It was a small one. So fun. And then my Barbies had like combs and makeup things. Really fun to play with. So it would have been better if Barbie were a lot. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. That song come out ages ago, but wouldn't that have been a better song for the movie if it just came out? You know, the song was like smacking you. Would be good. Would have been good for the Barbie movie. Well, one thing about it, the Ken looks realistic. Oh, well, the picture I saw, he looks. He did look realistic in it. Is this blue about out? I 
Aqua? Was it Aqua Sun uh, Barbie Girl? Aqua? Probably a one hit wonder, wasn't it? Aqua. One hit wonder moment. It was popular song back in the 90s. I think it was, wasn't it? In the 90s. Barbie Girl. Oh, well, this blue, I think, is about to go out on me. Hey, this is pretty nice like this. Blend it with... Well, it looks interesting the way it's covering the... For some reason, I'm in the movie color of stars black. I have a feeling I might get the color Christopia today, maybe. Then I need to color a uh, page with you guys in Daily Hour, too. I need a color page in there. Since I'm in a mood to record videos a lot. It's helping my channel. It's helping it. It was needing some help and it is helping my channel. We'll use gray instead recording videos. And luckily, like I said, I'm glad I'm able to record some shorts. So it's amazing how when you record videos more, it helps. It's, it looks like it's helped be a subscriber some too. And it would be nice if I could go at it every day and record. Um, if I, you guys might get tired of seeing chat, but that's what probably what I do if I could if I could do that. Go on and color. I wish I could really, you know, stay with it and go try to go every day at it. But thank goodness it has helped me doing this, my channel. I've had my channel about four years, I think, guys. In all, about four years. Might go around her with this gray. That would be in neat, different. Instead of the blue, go around with the gray. Oh. Do you guys like color mermaids? Have to be in the mood for it, but here lately I have been. Strange. I've noticed on Deborah Moore's group, a lot of people's color mermaids. And that helps, and that makes me want to color a mermaid. Hold on a minute, I'll be right back, guys. I'll just leave this going. Hey, Janet.
go there. I've got my lamplight over my markers in the floor here, and I'm using my phone camera light. Did you guys enjoy the video of me recording, recording in the living room? Could you see the picture okay when I've done that? Yeah. Hope you can see it good and everything. But I'm glad, like I said, my holder, my phone holder worked. That was good because I wasn't sure on that if it would, you know, if it would work or not. Because I have a different phone. and Well, it's the same phone, but a different phone cover. Yeah, better phone cover, really. I'm going to share on my Instagram today, if I think of it, and tell you guys that girl's name that I like. She's doing the dot method, and I asked her what she used. I said, you used Posca pen. No, she didn't use Posca. She said, uh, I, I forgot what it was, but I'll post what it is. It looks really good. I might, I might get the pens. I think it was ha -hoo -hoo, dual tip markers. I've got some of those. I believe it's what she used something else looks really good but i might give it a go i have done the dot, dot method before i've got some dot markers but hers looks really good i like it she said i could share share it on my page on my instagram her work and give her credit and she is on instagram too so Put dots on these skulls here. Well, no, I'm not. I'm gonna color them in. Change my mind. How fun this has been coloring this page. So Casper didn't want to come in here and lay down on the pillow. Shame on you, Casper. I like her better with the colors and her dark skin. Looks really good. Made sure to put two pieces of cardstock down because uh, I didn't want uh, to go through any. See, there's like the paper right here. How it is. We got skulls here. Mermaid wonders. Let me see here.
say about it. Ad they debut publishing dot com twenty eight twenty twenty sixteen. These mermaids belong to and then we've got quotes over here and a picture of butterfly. Louisa, Louisa May Alcott. I'm not afraid of storms, for I'm learning how to sail my ship. See, beautiful the way it's how it is, and the line art's really nice. It's easy to believe we are each waves and forget why we are also the ocean. John J. Muth, something like that. There's some pretty little fish here. Look at the cute dolphin. I don't think I'll read the quotes, guys. I think I can do like this so you can see it. And you can pause it if you want to read it. In case you want to uh, pause it and read the, the quotes, I'll do that. So you can see what the quote is. But probably a lot of you guys haven't seen this book. I've done a flip of my books before the Deborah books, but it's been a while on it, so you probably really can't um, remember remember this book much. And there's a quote here. Mark Twain. Beautiful book. I definitely would get this book if you like mermaids because it's really a winner of a book. Beautiful book. I'm glad, like I said, I'm glad I finally colored in this book. C.S. Lewis. Look how pretty that is. I'm going to have to color another mermaid with you guys on camera out of this book. Here's Dolly Parton. So I hope you guys don't get tired of seeing mermaids because I may color another one. Mother Teresa. Probably color another one in here. This is, I'm sure you guys will enjoy me coloring. I wonder, you know, I'm, not, I'm curious to know how pencils will do on this paper. I know pencils will do excellent on here. Look at this, how beautiful this is. This is the cover right here. And there's the one I called today in the quote. Can't see the quote much when once you color the page though. You can a little bit, but not not as much. But this way you can see what we can see what the quote is before I color the pages. I believe this is her best mermaid book. My favorite one she's got. Oh, mermaids. There's Marilyn Monroe. Rosa Parks. I want to show you guys the Sunlight Drawing page I did where I had to fix the yellow and we'll see if there's any more yellow pages in it. For some reason, the Sunlight Drawing books of certain ones I'm having. Trouble with pages, yeah, one. Excellent, wonderful book, Princess Diana. And then here's the turtles here. So definitely get this book, definitely. And here's what the cover looks like, Mermaid Wonders. 
Let me get my soft drawing book. This is the one I had to fix the page in. It was yellow. And it was this one right here. And the bird's funky colors. I didn't have to change the bird's colors. So in a way, I'm glad I did use, uh, took the peach out because there's pink here. There's already enough pink in the picture. So it does, it did turn out good. And I fixed the yellow. Um, 16, light blue, yeah. 12 was the yellow green. And then, and stem for, uh, sometimes I use this color right here for green. Um, it just depends on what mood I'm in. Let's see. Green 13. Yeah, like this color right here for green sometimes. just It just depends on the mood. Now, let's see if there's any more yellow pages in here, and I'll see. Let's see here. Yeah, right here, see? This one's yellow. Two, gray. Four, brown, luckily. And then we got the five, the tan, the six, the peach again, where it's yellow. Uh, red orange not too much yellow but down some yellow one on the owl picture I hate that too but now that one I just showed you was worse than the owl picture so that may be the only one That is yellow, hopefully. Yep. I'm looking here. Yep. Hopefully this one isn't. Nope. Okay, good. Alligator picture. Look, there's the fish. Luckily not yellow. Okay, good. And a weird looking bug. I finished their other book that was like this. And I hope this one's not yellow. Yes, it is. It's bad yellow. It's a marker I'm using, isn't it? That's causing this. So. See now, six. We got again the same problem. Six is peach and five is tan. And up here, 15, I'd have to. Okay, aqua green will cover it. 14, a dark green's good. That's where the yellow is. 11, yellow. 10 is yellow orange. You should be able to fix it. It's just right in here. It'll be a task. But I want to, I'll try to fix this one and see, see if I can. Might have to change the color to fix it. I don't know what marker it is. And luckily, I did this one after another, so. I've colored quite a bit in here, actually, haven't I? This is a fun book. When did I get this one? Let me look and see when I got it. February 2023, yep. So, thank you guys for hanging with me, and I'll try to be back again tomorrow and do another coloring chat with you guys for, for Saturday. So, have a good day. See you again, everybody.